Hey everyone, welcome back to The Sims Orphanage. So, in this episode, this will be the final episode, and I I kind of thought that the way that I, I decided, originally this was supposed to be like an orphanage challenge, but I kind of thought maybe this is just going to be like a mini-series to kind of show like a pre-adaptation to the murder house that Noah and Emma are living in now. Obviously, this does not look like the murder house. And the reason why will be revealed in the next, in this episode. But, you guys, I have a little bit of stuff to tell you first. Um, obviously you guys know, in a couple episodes ago, Taylor, which was one of the uh, orphans, was locked in a room by Thana here. And she ended up accidentally killing him, which caused these two to have a little bit of a riff between them, which is Carmen and Thana, and Carmen threatened to tell the police, so Thana has something planned with, for uh, for Carmen that she's going to pretty much have her banished from the thing, because now that she's a ghost, she could be banished from the house, which means she can't never come back, and so she will be gone, but as for the twins, um, you... You will take notice that they're gone as well. Nothing actually bad happened to them. But behind the scenes, I accidentally deleted them. So what we're going to do is we're just going to say that their grandmother found them and um, adopted them. And since they are family, they don't have to do the friends or anything like that. So that's the why, that's the way we did it. But anyways, Wade is stating... I really want to be friends with someone, but they don't seem to really want to be friends with me. How can I make them my friend? And he's asking Thana this. Um, I think Thana would just say, make one good grand ingestion gesture. But anyways, which leaves us with three orphans, which is Wade, Carmen, and Greta. So, in this episode, though... There is, this is going to be the final episode, so there is a lot of things that's happening in this episode. Obviously, Thana has decided that she's going to, um, have Carmen banished from the hotel, or, like, banished from the place, so she's going to go ahead and do that now. So she has banished Carmen now to where Carmen cannot come back. And all the because Carmen pretty much threatened to tell the police that what she did to Taylor. But that's not gonna go well with Wade and Greta. But also in the last episode, guys, we did actually have an adoption. And that adoption was of one of the orphans. I forget his name. To be honest with you, I'm sorry. But he was adopted by a couple that was really, really sweet. But the way we're going to do this is Wade has, like, heard through Carmen that she kind of feels like, like Thana might be doing something like that. So, and unfortunately, the uh, butler's going to have to die as well because of that. But... He is going to go ahead and have Greta and talk to Greta about what he has planned to do and see what she wants to do. Or if she just wants to wait it out and do the orphanage thing or what she has to say about it. He's like, listen, I can't say too much, but I do have something planned. And I'll talk to you more about it in later, but it could be quite graver consequences. And she, Greta's like, I'm on board. Whatever it is, I'm on board. So Greta is pretty much right away on board with Wade. And another thing is, she's like, now that I can tell you exactly what it is. I think that someone needs to end this orphanage because they're not treating people right. I've read the history about this place, including there was a girl that used to live here named Pepper before we all arrived. 
and she was electrocuted to death. Yes, the pepper is, side note, yes, pepper is this pepper from my world, our Sims World series. But anyways, she lived here, and she was a, pretty much electrocuted to death. So I think that, and I think Thana did it, and they said that it was a mysterious thing, but they think it was the headmistress, which is Thana, because Thana's been working here for years. And plus what she did to Taylor, and... I haven't seen Carmen around at all. The twins are gone, which obviously their grandmother picked them up. So I think it's just us two that's left, and we need to figure out what to do. And I was kind of thinking, maybe we could end this. Like, we need to end this before anybody else gets hurt from it. And she's, he's like, what do you say? So, Thana is sleeping. And these two are going to go ahead and head outside here. And they're going to start a fire in the house and make it seem like it was an accident. But it's actually going to burn the house down. So I'll be back in just a minute. So they have set fire. They've kind of threw a firework into her room to where she will burn to death. As like a punishment for killing them, other orphans or whatever, and thus ending the orphanage itself. It's kind of sad because you, you don't want to see a human die, but she was a really bad person. She pretty much was treating the orphans not right. And now the orphanage is going to go up in flames. And obviously Wade and Gretchen are outside. They're safe. They, they're acting like they're scared, but really they're not. They are acting like they are and also the butler is in here as well but the butler really can't like she could escape i don't know why she's not but she can but they pretty much ended thana which is their way of saying no more the ter the torture no more of all this it's time to end this orphanage once and for all So, I'll be back in just a minute. Five years later. Wade grew up and married one of the twins, Journey. They adopted Greta as their own and are said to be having twins. Born in a few months. Two boys named Taylor. One named after their fallen friend. And Tristan. Greta is... Now in middle school, she is to be in high school, but she failed a couple years. But all together, they are living the good life in Salani. So with that said, we found out that Wade and them have moved on with their lives. Are now living in a place called Salani, which we might be running into them very soon. Just putting it out there. Hint, hint. But... They're, Wade is now married to Journey, and they have adopted Greta as their own, and they have a set of twin boys on the way, so you guys will not want to miss that once we finally meet them in person on The Sims World. So, look out for that, but that won't be happening for a couple more weeks, but next week, guys, I do have an announcement for you guys before we end. Sims 4 Bachelorette Challenge will be starting Next week on Saturday, I repeat, it will be starting next week on Saturday, and it will follow the journey of a man trying to find his forever wife or husband because he is a bisexual man, so there will be both men and women living in the house, and each episode, someone will be eliminated until the final person will become his wife or husband. So... That should be interesting. It'll be all starting next week. So thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. Peace.